Zone. Rapid Zone. <laughs> Welcome to the Rapid Zone, to the War Zone. Uh, today we just want to kind of catch up and give you guys an uh, overall idea of what is going on here. And then we'll do more episodes on each specific area of the build because there's way too much going on right now to do one episode on everything that's going on, okay? So we'll give you, again, like a, like a summary today and then we'll dive into each area more in detail soon. So today, welcome to the interior. Uh, I want to show you, or we want to show you, what we've been planning to do and what we've been doing here in the, in, uh, in the interior. And uh, as you can see, uh, this is probably the worst looking place in the entire boat. Check it out. <clears throat> I know it looks like a total chaos, but it's at the moment when I'm migrating the tools and uh, materials and cables and all that stuff down into, into the uh, workshop, actually organizing it. So kind of in a transition at the moment. Mm -hmm. But you can see that we completely uh, um, uh, dismounted the, uh, the whole kitchen uh, furniture. So the kitchen is, as you see, completely empty. Uh, this, these are bits and pieces of furniture from the salon that we're modifying a little bit. But the kitchen is going to be all new. Uh, and it's already been pretty much designed all the way. I think, what, are we done designing Almost. the kitchen? Almost. Okay, <laughs> Almost, cool. Yes. Good. No? Here. Okay, Anya is showing me that I need to go to the, to the, uh, cabin. To the cabin. We're going to show the cabin. <coughs> okay. On the way, you can see we're going to change also the... Uh, the Upholstery. The, uh, yes. Mm -hmm. So, mm -hmm. here we are. Uh, our beautiful polyamory is no longer beautiful for the moment, but it's going to be even more beautiful when we're done with it. Mm -hmm. And uh, right now it's a changing room for us <laughs> to go into our work clothes. But the, uh, there's a couple different ideas still floating around how we're going to arrange the, uh, the furniture over here. Um, Adam has some great ideas about how to create a desk over here, so we'll see we'll go, what we go with. It will with. be really convenient to yeah. have the office yeah. space here. And, and just close the door. <laughs> yep, the bed is staying the same way. Nothing changes here. And we're actually going to have a shelf, if you can turn around, we're going to have a shelf kind of from here to there because we need to hide the three big electric motors for the new um, electric winches. So honey, your sailing is going to get a lot easier <laughs> from, this, uh, from, this, uh, mm -hmm. from this day. Anyway, uh, so not a whole lot is going to happen here. I mean, we're going to do the new flooring, right? And we're going to repaint the, the walls the same way just to refresh them. Uh, but just about the same design is going to stay. Mm -hmm. So new, new mirror, of course, <laughs> you know, that kind of stuff. So. And kids room is going to be probably the same. The kids room, yeah, we're not going to go in there the because right now it's the, uh, it's the place we'll where, we store, where we store the tools and uh, and stuff that we use yeah. to work right As now. As you can see, under the bed was always a big uh, closet to us just to store mm -hmm. our stuff. Exactly. And oh, the one of the modifications that's going to happen is, is we're going to put this uh, special mechanism on top of the bed that's going to allow the bed to open up like this with mm. the mattress. It's so that's really going to be super cool. cool because we're going to be able to access easily without taking everything apart. And easy to maintain yeah. a clean easy space. Easy to maintain clean space pockets. and everything else. Mm. Uh, this is the aforementioned GPS antenna that's going to go now on the mast and the, and the right stern is going to be completely clean. So that's cool. Um, yeah, all this, uh, most of this stuff is going to land in the workshop today to, uh, to organize things well. Mm. All right? Okay, so. All right, don't fall into any holes. Yeah, it's really dangerous here <coughs> on the way. This is the engine room. So and on the way we're gonna uh, skip our best ever toilet ever. It's yep. now in a mess. But we're not gonna uh, put a, a lot of a lot of changes here. Only new closets here, some shelves and. And system-wise, also the uh, all the drains are gonna go mm. there now directly to uh, to black grey water tank. So everything is gonna be sort of up to up to standards uh, in case if we want to stay a longer time somewhere in the marina. Mm -hmm. Anyway. The, uh, the salon. Uh, as you see, there's some changes here with the, with the uh, furniture. The way we're uh, creating it right now is Adam thought about this cool idea about creating the hinges here. And we're going to be able to basically open up with the, with the uh, cushions on, uh, open up and basically have the space uh, ready to go. And actually the same way, open up this way 
the uh, the vertical parts. I don't know uh, if you remember, but we used to uh, store food here, so this was it's it's gonna be really cool to have the really easy uh, access. And this is <laughs> this is the new black grey water tank. Yeah, it's probably gonna be mixed, mm. and uh, it's going there mm -hmm. once we uh, once we replace mm -hmm. the. Uh, uh, can you show that? Mm -hmm. So this is, this is our salon floor, right? Uh, we actually had this whole. We actually had this hole originally, and uh, so we cut it out again. It was just basically uh, um, glued on Sikaflex, and uh, so we so we took this out, and we managed to move and we managed to move the the diesel uh, tank into this empty space forward, slightly forward, and we're going to put the black water tank on top. In this way, we gain this entire space here uh, for. Fridges, systems, and that kind of stuff. And on both sides, we're going to create some shelves. Uh, we haven't decided exactly how we're going to do it, but uh, but the stuff I showed you on the on the right side, the the things uh, that basically open up like this, we're going to create them over here just as well, uh, because it seems like a simple, effective solution to gain this entire space and easily access it when when we need to do it. So that, so it doesn't have to be a, a major pain every time we we try to take anything in and out of there. So uh, and. I know it looks like a total war zone, but this is about it, you know, and that's probably two months worth of work. Um, navigation station. Navigation, gonna stay give the or take, same. stays the same. We might do a little bit of update to electronics. Uh, we're probably going to have a bigger chart plotter over here because this one gave away, gave away after seven years of work. So I think I think it's time. Mm -hmm. um, and, uh, and just maybe take a look in the front cabin, just to and the front cabin. show you. Yeah, the because front cabin is taken apart, but all the parts are actually yeah. still there. So we can put it back together fairly easily after we put the carpet in and after we put the new upholstery in there. Yeah. So that's the, uh, that's the stuff that's happening right now. <laughs> Enough for the interior? <laughs> interior, yeah. <laughs> and we're going to dive into the details on each project more, especially electronics and... Uh, yeah, when the time out, comes for yeah, it. So yeah. Keep fingers crossed. Keep your fingers crossed. <laughs> Segredos vem da floresta de luz Pachamama, Pachamama. Abre a consciência dos seus filhos a crescer.